Hey guys, this is Lachlan Adrian, and today I had the privilege to interview Miss Redding, who is the curator of the art show, as well as a few of her students, and you're about to hear what they had to say. I'm here with Miss Redding, who has been the art teacher for 16 years. So, what has been your favorite part about the art show, and how did it go? I think this year's favorite part of the art show was seeing all my former students. I put out a thing on Facebook last show and uh, so a lot of students I haven't seen in eight, nine, ten years came in just to see the show and you know besides the parents which was nice. Uh, so that was my favorite part of this show was seeing some of my former students. So what have been some of your highlights while teaching art here? To make I sense? think that the best thing, the highlights for me is seeing everyone get past their negativity of I can't do art and do better than they thought they could. There are always some students like V. Tran and Nia Reed who have come in with a lot of talent, but even they can grow. But then also I have like what I call the average students, you know, the kids that don't come in with a lot of talent who get better and better and better every year. And that's what kind of, you know, makes my heart sing because they get better because they care and they work at it and they're willing to, you know, apply what they learn. So what will you miss most about MHS? Definitely interacting with the students. Uh, I love, I love my advanced art because those are the kids that want to be in here and want to do art. Uh, I tease my art ones that I'm mean when I'm not being nice and I'm nice when I'm not being mean. Basically, you know, I don't, I'm, I'm kind of strict, I don't let people act stupidly. Um, but I love interacting with the students and seeing them grow in their talent and abilities. Well, thank you for everything that you have done for our school and our community. Thank well, you. Well, thank you. <laughs> Alrighty. I have a few Art3 students with me here, V Tran and Molly Green. So how do you, did you feel coming in freshman year to art versus how you do now? Okay, so as a freshman, I felt really intimidated because Miss Redding was like seen as a really strict like art teacher, but she was like really good. But now I feel like way more confident and I'm really excited for next year, even though she won't be here. Yeah, I just my confidence levels went way up and I feel like I'm able to like relax and enjoy art a lot more now because I just I'm used to the atmosphere and So what was your favorite project that you put into the art show this year? Um, my favorite project that I put in the art show was a picture, it was like a crazy animal um, theme and I did a picture of Mr. Francis's dog Tater because he asked me to and it's like crazy colors and it was just a really fun project. So. so I had like two, there's one up front, it's like a drawing so it's like just shading and it was of an Indian's crazy, chief crazy horse and I also did another watercolor one. It took me a long time but it's like colors coming out of her head and like a heart down here so I really like that one too. Since Miss Redding is retiring after this year is there anything that you would like to say to her? Okay um, I love you Miss Redding and thank you for teaching me like everything about art and making me more confident in how to do art and being a great art teacher and I hope you enjoy your time off. Um, I love you Miss Redding thank you for giving me three years of joy in our class and I'm excited to continue doing art forever and thank you for being a great teacher and teaching me so much. We're going to miss you a lot but yeah. 